Hello everybody, World's Play In are about to start in less than one week from now on. So this is the time to present you my top 20 players coming into Worlds. We are going to start with place 16 to place 20, starting with Nuggery on place 20 from Dumb One Gaming out of the LCK. I think Nuggery really developed as a stable player, so he isn't this coin flip anymore that either destroys in lane or gets destroyed, depending on how the jungle impacts the top lane, so he's much more reliable. Um, I think that's one of the reasons why Down One Gaming is this good this season. Um, I think he's a stable player, he's top 20, maybe even better, but I place him at um, yeah, rank 20. So already I said I would probably place him higher so um, this is just my power ranking from the player so if you have any opinions um, any other opinion than I have just post it in the comments below let me know what you think about my power ranking um, yeah with that being said let's head on to place number 19 that's BDD from Gen G also out of the LCK <laughs> you already recognize there are four players in the place 16 to 20 from the LCK. Um, BDD has a lot of experience, he's one of the key players from Gen G. Um, he's really good in the mid lane, but I think that there are a lot of better mid laners at Worlds, and so I don't think that, yeah, he deserves a higher place. Place 19 I think is pretty good. Let's head on to Deft from DRX also from the LCK. Um, in my opinion Deft is one of the best AD carries, if not the best AD carry um, in Worlds. He has a lot of experience but he's not the kind of player that really crushes the lane and plays and snowballs the game from there. Uh, he's much more controlled and low risk, uh, low reward player and I think with the current meta this is not enough to be um, a higher rank than rank 18. Let's head on to Kenyon uh, from Dumb One Gaming. I think Kenyon is a really really good jungler coming out of the LCK but he's not quite at the level of um, the junglers from the LPL so I think there is the big gap where I placed him um, below rank 15 and not higher. Same thing for self-made at place 16. He's actually the only player from Fnatic that um, got into my ranking. Um, one of three players out of the LEC. I think he's the carry from Fnatic. Um, but his problem is that if you don't put him on a scaling jungler and a jungler that has the potential to carry then he won't be able to carry so um, not like let's say Jankos for example um, Jankos back in the days not this season that's why I didn't place him there uh, but last season for example even though when he was on Sejuani or Zack for example he was also carrying the game and carrying his laners, but Selfmade isn't able, isn't quite able to do this yet. Maybe he will surprise me at Worlds, but I think the goal for Fnatic will be to give him the opportunity to carry from the jungle and give him Graves or um, Eve or something like that. So that are my uh, rank 16 to 20, and let's head on with place 15 and above. Alright, so let's head on with place 11 to 15. Uh, there are now four players from the LPL, one from the LEC. Um, let's start with Loken. He is the AD carry from JDG out of the LPL. I think JDG is one of the three best teams coming into Worlds. I think Loken isn't their best player. He performs really well. 
but I don't think that he quite has the experience yet to be one of the best players coming into the tournament he is. Um, my second best, AD Carry, um, because he really performed well, um, but he isn't quite at the top 10 yet. Then let's get on to Peanut. I think he has the potential to be higher, but the problem with me is that LGD is kind of a coin flip team, I guess. That's why they finished um, fourth in the LPL, and that's why they have to go through play ins. I think uh, Peanut is one of the reasons he is really experienced, but still, he sometimes just doesn't perform. I don't know why, um, because he has the talent, he has the opportunities, he has the experience, but sometimes um, he just doesn't perform. But when he performs, he's really a carry player and he really enables his, his laners and the other players to carry. Then to Wanda, um, I think Wanda could be higher too, but he didn't have the best split in the LEC. Like all the other players from um, G2 Esports, that why, uh, that's why there are only two players from, from G2 Esports in there. Wanda just ha didn't have the best split of his career. Um, still he's at place 13 because he can play so many champs and you can place him on a tank and he will perform. You can place him even on Soraka top lane and he will pe perform and he's a huge part of the G2 success during the last years and uh, when you're watching the LEC finals then you, you're seeing that he can perform when he needs to. Uh, then let's continue with the top laner from JDG out of the LPL Zoom. Um, yeah, I think he's a he's a pretty decent top laner, um, but compared to the other uh, players from JDG, I sometimes have the feeling that you just put him on on a tank or uh, a champion that that is. Um, just surviving the lane and the other players of the team can carry him through this but you have to say that sometimes Zoom has his shining moments and he performs really well um, there are still some yeah, dark side of his place so that's why I placed him on place 12 out of t um, yeah, the best 20 players coming into Worlds 2020 then 369, um, top laner from top esports out of the LPL. I think he's really, really good. He's my best top laner in this ranking, but I think uh, during this meta, that's why Zoom and Wander aren't higher as well. Um, I think top lane isn't the lane where the big plays and the carries come from that's much more mid lane and jungle um, sorry for that um, i think 369 is a really really good player he has his moments to shine but at the moment most of the top lane plays come from tanks and he performs really well on them he has his big moments where he really kind of carries the team fights um, but I think top laners shouldn't be ranked higher at the moment because they are just not able to carry. Maybe Worlds will surprise me, we will see something else like Lucian top, Akali top, um, maybe even Irelia top. So that's it for the places 20 to 11. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you agree or if you disagree. Let me know why if you disagree. If you enjoyed this video, leave a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing if you want to see more of those videos. If you want to see the places 10 to 1, just look in the description of this video. I'm going to post the link there. See you in the next video. Bye.